Hello, my name is April. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to repot my Schefflera plant, also known as the umbrella tree. This is the nursery where my plant was purchased from. It was a birthday gift from, from my birthday that just passed in April. I picked up this pot from Target. It was on clearance for $5.60, marked down from $8. My soil is from the Home Depot. I have a cactus palm and citrus potting mix. Also, I have just the regular potting mix. This pot has very good drainage. Some of my leaves were turning brown or black, so I took a few to the nursery and um, the woman there told me that it was possibly because the plant was not getting enough light. These are very high light plants. They love light. So I moved it to a window where it will receive tons of sunlight. And I'm going to see how well it does once I repot it. And hope that I resolve the issue and um, don't get any more black or brown leaves. Let's get started. So I placed the plant into a large trash bag just so I can remove some of the soil before I take it out of the nursery pot. And I'm going to take it out with my hands just so that I don't disturb the roots too much. Okay, so that's going to take a while. So what I'm going to do is loosen it up a bit and then pull it out of the pot and break the soil from around the roots. So I'm just going to go around it gently and then pull it out of the nursery pot. Okay, so I loosened the plant up as much as I could. It's ready to be pulled out. But before I pull it out, I'm going to fill up my new pot with the soil so that it's ready to go. So I used about a third, um, or I filled it up about a third of the way with the cactus, palm, and citrus mix. And then I'm going to fill the rest with the regular potting mix and mix it in really well. So I'm just going to use my hands to mix it up. That's why it's a good idea to wear gloves, just so your hands don't get super dirty. Okay, the plant is out of its nursery pot. I'm just going to break up the old soil and then place it into its new home. Be gentle. So I'm going to leave that in the way. All right, we are almost done. Look at those lovely roots. Now's a good time to also inspect for pests or bugs. Okay, so this is what it's looking like. I did remove about half of the soil from the pot and put it into the nursery container just so that I have enough room for the roots to be um, to grow some more so that's about how much soil was left in here and now I'm going to fill it up okay so I'm all done it was a little bit harder to do with one person so if you have someone to help you um, go ahead and ask one of your friends to help you to repot your plant I'm just gonna prune some of the leaves off two of the lower leaves fell off and it's okay because this one was starting to turn brown and I'm okay with that. So I'm going to give my plant a nice drink of water. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you have any care tips for the Chef Lara or Umbrella Tree, please feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you. See you in the next video.